This HAN Network video is brought to you by Coastal Orthopedics. From Trinity Catholic High School, this is the HAN Network's 2016 Winter Sports Tour. I'm Frank Renito, and I'm joined now with the boys' hockey captains for the Crusaders. They are Zach Lockwood and Connor Scanlon. Connor, let me start with you. We were just talking. You guys had a roster of only nine players last year. You're up to 14 now. That'll obviously help, but what was that experience like playing on a team with so little skaters? Well, it really bonded us together as a team. We only lost two seniors last year, so we'll be a much better unit this year, and we learned to work hard and like what it means to win since we had very limited last year. Zach, you'll be the goalie for the Crusaders this year. What's going to make this defensive unit uh, better or even a stronger team compared to last season? Um, you know, we have a lot of new defensemen, a lot of new freshmen coming in. We have a lot of new talent. A couple kids came from the Oilers, another hockey program. Um, our defense has been really solid in the past, so I'm not really too worried about that. Uh, you mentioned the Connecticut Oilers, such a strong program. With those new faces joining the roster, what are some of the team building exercises or bonding things you guys will do now with the roster set? Um, a couple things we do. I mean, we do have like workouts before the game and after the games. We do have uh, pasta dinners, you know, bring the whole team together. We do have um, a clinic that we did before the season even started to get to know everyone, get the team together, and just work on what we need to do. Now, Connor, Stanford and Westville are a co-op program now, so the city championship really comes down to one game. Does it make it a little bit better knowing that if you beat them, you're beating two schools? Yeah, it does make it better, especially since they're two big schools that combined and we're only a school of 400 kids. It'll feel a great feeling of satisfaction knowing that 400 kids were able to beat two schools combined that have around like 3,000 or 4,000. Zach, you guys were towards the bottom of the FCAC last year. What's going to make this team different as you make that climb back towards a playoff push? We're willing to work hard. We have a lot more players, a lot more heart than I think we did last year. We're a hardworking team. We may not have a lot of kids, but at the end of the day, we're going to try our best. That's awesome, man. And, Connor, if you guys were going to set goals for the season, what do you hope to accomplish as a group? We accomplished uh, to make states, to win at least eight games, and just work our best every game and knock it out worked. Well, we can't wait to see you boys on the ice. Best of luck this year, and thanks again for taking time with us. Thank you. Make sure you stay tuned as the HAN Network's 2016 Winter Sports Tour rolls on.